message to Congressman Heck. You know, we have the highest unemployment rate in the nation. And that hasn't been just for this week or this month. That has been for over a year. Uh, and today, I can tell you, I'm in the jobs business. There are no jobs coming to this state. So to question whether or not Congress is going to reauthorize the unemployment funds that come to this state is ridiculous that we have to be standing here today even talking about You know, this. I know a little bit about that. Uh, growing up, uh, I had a single mom, was a young teenage single mom, and we knew what it was like to struggle. But it's safety nets like the ones we're talking about right now and community support that allowed my mom to finish college and allowed me to become the person that I am. The Red Sea. And at the Red Sea, they was kind of like confounded what we going to do now. And the Lord just gave Moses one instruction. Tell your people to go forward. And as the people begin to march to the Red Sea, God opened up the Red Sea. Right. So God won't do nothing for us until we move He's forward. Four kids. I'm a single mom. Been unemployed for one year. I have lost my home like many have. My mother is back here behind me. She has stepped up and let me and my kids move into her home. My mother gets Social Security, which is only $650 a month. My unemployment helps pay power, water, gas, and food. That's it. I've applied everywhere. Since September of 2009, I've put out maybe 100 resumes, went back to school. I've even tried to get a job as a cab driver. Without a job, and losing my unemployment insurance, I'll not be able to make it. I'll lose my house. Then what do I do? Am I supposed to disappear? Go back and tell him to pass that bill. Good job now. Good job now. Good job now.